excited? I am excited. I'm happy to have my lawnmower in operation again. So this is the old fuel filter um, and it came apart when I went to just detach the lines to check and make sure it wasn't clogged. This thing just boop, popped right apart. She's running like a champ. <laughs> Stronger than she has in a long time. I'm so, very excited. So you just fixed the lawnmower. How do you feel? Pretty awesome. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> There's a great amount of satisfaction that comes with getting your hands all oily and <laughs> smelling like gasoline and getting it fixed. So I'm very excited because now I can get on with some of my projects that I was requiring its use for. Very nice. You want to show us what you did? Uh, sure. Um, so this still needs to be attached. but Yeah, I still need to attach that, but it's hot right now, so I'm going to have to wait on that. But we put a new fuel filter on right here, and then we pulled this part off here, and Robert cleaned this all up. This is our fuel shutoff. So there's a bunch of gunk and crap in there, and he cleaned that all out really good. Um, Got it all cleaned up, and then he put markings on there, which is on and off, because the thing, it just would hardly move, and you couldn't sometimes tell if it was on or off or what. So anyway, we did that. And then this piece up here was busted. This piece up here was busted. And um, this lawnmower, we paid $150 for, <laughs> like, five years ago, like five and a half years ago. And so... Um, we just kind of jury rig it and keep it going as long as we can. So anyway, this part was busted so the choke wasn't working because um, this whole panel would move anytime you try to move the choke. So I zip tied it here so I drilled a hole in the hard plastic here and then um, I zip tied it to the frame so this couldn't move and now our choke works uh, correctly. So. so yeah, with those, between those things, um, I think it's seems to be running good now. Keeps running. Eventually we'll have to get a new seat for it. I know. <laughs> good job, dude. Thanks.